Hey you guys, it's Deja Janae. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be doing Bantu Knots on Stretched Hair. Woo, child! <laughs> so let's just get right into it. So we're starting off with blow-dried hair, and I had it up in a bun. And I don't do my um, sections evenly or anything, so the parts are uneven. My hair is uneven. Not that cute! And your hair is uneven. You look dusty. <laughs> Y'all do not mind the straggly ends. But yeah, so I just start with like bigger pieces in the back because I feel like it's less important. Um, it's all depending on how big you want your curls or whatever to be. So I just start it bigger in the back. So for the band tonight, you want to wrap your hair all around, keep twisting it around. And then you want to start forming a little bantu knot and you're going to twist your hair around that piece that you keep doing. <laughs> that seems like it doesn't make sense. But yeah, when your hair is like um, blow dried or whatever, it always comes a loose. So I often have to like keep twisting and keep twisting while I'm doing the bantu knot. Yeah guys, I forgot to mention that I am on the phone throughout the entire video, so don't mind me, I'm going to be laughing and talking and all types of stuff, just don't mind the faces and all that. But yeah, um, and I do have regular iPhone headphones, so any AirPod users, if y'all can't hear broke, then click off the video. <laughs> So I did like laugh so many times throughout this video. So what I did was I made a little compilation of my laughs. So please enjoy this obnoxious compilation of my mini laughs. made you laugh or at least put a smile on your face but if it was cringe i'm sorry <laughs> but i did forget to mention also i was just so ashy in this video literally my elbows are almost white and then my freaking hands are ashy I i'm just a hot mess so yeah here's a close-up of me doing the bantu knot or whatever i did leave a little piece of hair out but i feel like i like threw it in there somehow like i did leave a couple of strands of hair out for a few different bantu knots but then like i never noticed so they just kind of got thrown in there but um yeah i'm just continuing to bend to knot the rest of my head So I'm finally to the front section of my hair. So in the front, I do like to do more bantu knots. I think I do about five because I want them to come out like nice in the front and like be defined. The back doesn't really matter as much.
A little link check in the front. Nothing major. <laughs> My ends are so bad. Now that I'm on the last bantu knot, I am going to wrap these up, my scarf and my bonnet, and sleep in these. I think it was for two days actually. I've learned that I really like my hair after keeping in um, like twists or whatever for two days instead of one because it just comes out better. But um, often when your hair is straightened or whatever, uh, the bantu knots can come loose more easily, so that's what I was doing, checking for any of those, and I found one in the back. I'm back, so two days later, all knotted up, about to take out my bantu knots, and it's my first day of my last semester, senior year. We've been to graduate this semester, okay? <laughs> so yeah, make sure you have some type of oil. I'm using my coconut oil to take out my bantu knots. And bantu knots, when, um, bantu knots, period, they get more tangled. So some of them, you can see me struggling a little bit. Take your time. Don't be trying to yank your hair out. But yeah. Just when I thought I had them all done, I have forgotten. Them. So make sure you're not forgetting any of your bantu knots. Take them all out. Okay, guys. So this is the finished look first well last first day of classes look the bantu knots um, so i never really take out the front too much piece it apart too much because i want it to like stay intact and then this is the rest of the hair i'm all moving the camera everywhere instead of my head and this is the whole look because i've never worn a turtleneck before <laughs> like an actual turtleneck and then so this is like an hour later and I got exposed to the outside air which changes my hair every time so I like it better when it is exposed to the air because it helps it drop and fluff up some but yeah I'm just showing you guys my hair a little bit showing y'all my outfit because I thought it was cute or whatever I did add a little twist in the front of my hair just because I didn't like it just completely all down but thank you guys for watching ta-ta for now Mwah. like comment share and subscribe